It is Wednesday, my dudes. Yo. I just got this sick monitor. Oh, uh, okay. Cool. Oh, really? Alright, cool. So, basically, now that I'm here... <laughs> okay, AM radio. <laughs> Alright, well... It's been, what's it called? Dang, uh, it's been how long? Like one week? One week since I've had this vaccine and I still feel a-okay. That's the good news here. And then more news. Just got this sick $200 monitor here. It's curved, 144 hertz, 1 ms. It's pretty sick. Make uh, sure, I, Make sure you set your settings in Windows to allow 140 hertz. I did that the first day I got this thing. Nice. All right. All right. Hold on a second. I got. No, he's trying to fix it. I got it. I, I fixed it for one second. Hold on. I have to put the compressor back on now. For one second, he has to put the compressor back on. Testing. <laughs> testing. 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 <laughs> testing. <laughs> Tech support, did you try turning it off and turning it back on again? <laughs> That's the first thing you should always try. As I look into the camera, I notice that huh, maybe it's time for a haircut. Maybe. I don't know. That's what I feel like. Um... Uh, just, just, just get them when you feel like them. Just. NVIDIA. Come on, NVIDIA. Dang, it's the first time I turned my P turned on my PC today. What's going on? All right, my Ooh. video's back. Oh, we got microphones. Oh, All I right. know it. All right, hold on. We're going to do this again. Alright. Alright, we're, going, we're going back to the countdown right menu. Now. Yeah, we're yeah, we're, we're all back just to, vibing. Back yeah. to Megalomania. Yeah. We'll be back in a second, guys. Oh, okay, bye. Are we starting over? Yeah. Okay. Let's hit the ground running, guys. <laughs> we got this. The show hello everybody welcome to the gear swap podcast it say? is january 6th 2021 as you can see by the red tinting on my face birdie and i are currently snugged away in our bunker as the world falls apart around us it's so cold it's so cold yeah i just wanted to be comfy because i'm actually cold he's just being drama yeah i'm just being full of drama <laughs> yeah it's really it uh, hello, cold today. hello everybody i think that i hit the, the proper soundbite before but let's hit it again yeah it's that one 
it is Wednesday, my dudes. It is Wednesday, my dudes. It is Wednesday, my dudes. All right, we're going to stop the music. Hello to everybody out in the chat. Hello, everyone. Thank you very much for coming with us on our 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 intro that was so good we had to do it twice. <laughs> How long are you going to do this soft voice thing? Oh, I, I don't understand. Un until... You don't understand? No, what's going on? Oh, all right. Well, <laughs> we're just going to pretend like it's not happening then. No, it's uh, it's wonderful here. I love it. Um, all hail right. our leaders. They are wonderful and great. All oh, hail sure. our leaders. I don't like this direction of the podcast today. This all right, command. anyways, guys, how have your weeks been? <laughs> Christian wait, basically wait, wait, wait. In. I have to say hello to the people in chat. Oh, okay, then do it. I'd like to say a special hello to some of the faces that are out in chat at the beginning of the show today. We really appreciate your support. We have, out in the chat, we have Natalie Powers, myself, as the Marator. Welcome to all of us. I'm sure we're going to drop in from Boom Nasty later, Boom Town, Defenestrate. Powers is also a moderator out there. Almost forgot about you. You've already donated two bits. I appreciate that, my friend. Also out in the chat, we currently have Fire Mandrill, Frankenstein, Go With Them, Liana is Sparkly, Mr. X Ray Gun, Speedier, Trasino, and Waken by Sheep. Damn, haven't seen Joey. In have a, while. I haven't seen Joey in quite a quite a hot minute. It's the squad. Yeah, we got the, the we got the What's up? we've got the young crew in the house today. What's good, y'all? I genuinely hope that my voice is coming over beautifully and clear for everybody. <laughs> Waken says, "Woo, another child." <laughs> <laughs> what yes. is worse than a rapist? <laughs> Child. No. Child. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, all right, moving right along. Yeah, it's all right. The FBI is busy with other stuff. Today. They're not doing anything today. Good start. Good start. Good start. Um, FBI. So, yes. check-ins. Chris yeah. kind of already does, did his recap. Feeling good after the vaccine. Yeah. Liking his new monitor. It's that's got a great. curve in it, so that's fire. Um, What am I missing? Uh, You nailed it. You nailed it. Okay, so two big things. Love that. Um, I'm feeling very good about your reports after the vaccine. That feels good. Love that for you. But Kara had a different... Kara and my cousin had different reactions, though. So that's I the, saw that on part. her Snapchat. She was like, this shit sucks. She was... She was yeah, she was dying after the... Like, the day after. And no way. Does she have any my medical, cousin, medical like, implants that she did not disclose? No. Maybe, like, I think that you might be overthinking yeah. this reaction thing a little too Yeah, hard. I probably am. It's okay. Like, reactions to vaccines just happen all they, they It happens. Especially, like, when you're not used to it. It's like anything could, like, be triggered in your own body. Because everybody's I know. different. Bodies are weird. Yeah, dude. That is correct. Bodies are super weird. <laughs> Th that's for sure. sure. That's for sure. I want to know what this ghost is right here over my shoulder that's picking up because your hoodie is hanging off the thing, your jacket. Oh. It, like, focuses in on every once in a while. It's like, I think there's a human there. Oh, because of my jacket the way? Oh, yeah, because the arm is up yeah. like that? I'm, I'm playing... It kind of looks like the arm is a face, though. It right? does. It's Look, got, like, the little eye thing. That's creepy. Playing Phasmophoria like or whatever that game is right I now. Like uh, no, nah, bro, your place is just haunted. Uh, that's possible. No. <laughs> no. Don't put that on me. Birdie. Next. How was your week? It's been good. I've been doing research on social media stuff. It's not, I don't really love it, but like we're here, we're doing it. So that's fun. Oh, I haven't been liking it either. <laughs> <laughs> social oh, media, okay. Social media stuff stresses me out. I'm not even going to lie. Like analytics, algorithms, uh, all of that. Hashtags, what have you. Hate it. I the hashtags? Do um it it does it gives me fucking anxiety but like um i'm trying to do research about it because it's important just in general to know especially if you want to like run a business and stuff like that so that is true doing my due diligence you know whatever um aside from that i've been training a bunch i spent like six hours in the studio on saturday i was there for like three classes I was there from 11, well, 10, yeah, 11 till 
like four almost. Um, that might not be six hours, but it was a long after. <laughs> <laughs> um, lots of classes, lots of training, lots of practice, whatever. It was good. Um, making uh, content for the old the, the old Instagram, doing reels and whatever. So that's been fun. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the long and short of it. Do the my dancey favorite. dance. Yeah, I'm doing my little dancey dance. Exactly. Um, but yeah, doing good right now. Nice. Wonderful. Yes. Great. Super. All right, I'm officially too warm. Oh no. The blanket. Are you leaving the bunker? I am still going to attempt to talk in this voice. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So that was my week. That's, That's my good. recap. Wonderful. Yeah. Yay. Um, my turn. Hello to everybody. Welcome. Thank you for coming by again. We appreciate you. My week was stressful. May have had some moments over the weekend. Just general stress. A little stressy stress. Maybe that was last week. I don't remember. The, do they, all blurred, they all blurred stress. They all blurred together at this point. <laughs> we are... Oh, we got a sub here somewhere along the line. Oh, somebody subbed. Uh, that was 14 days ago. Oh. Okay. 14 days Never ago. Never mind. Well, thanks, much. guys. Well, my, my sub count went up by one, unless I just miscounted. Um, speaking of subs, we have reset our goal for... <laughs> Thank you, Hex. Hydrate. That is a good thing to tell everybody. Get your gallon of water a day, now. everybody. Boys and girls. Uh. Your gallon a day. I will not guarantee that it will keep the doctor away, but it's good for you. So, yes. You know. So we have reset our goals for January. Uh, we beat our initial goals for December, which was awesome. We didn't get to the stretch goals. They were very stretchy. Very stretchy. Phrasing. Uh, oh, but we have <laughs> goals of this month <laughs> uh, for the rest of January of 2021. Uh, we would like to get up to uh, 15 total subs. We're currently at 5 slash 6. I'll have to update that. And for bit donations, we're aiming for a total of 5,000 bits for the month. I think it's a reasonable goal. We're looking for it. Fingers crossed, guys. So yeah. if you guys feel like it, donate, sub, etc. You know, do do the thing. Mm -hmm. Make it happen. Uh, the if thing. you can't, whatever. Hang out. Enjoy. Chill. All good. Absolutely. Uh, we have a... I personally had our D&D &D sessions kick back up. So that was good times. Good times? Good. Good times. Great and good. Great and good. <laughs> good. <laughs> Uh, we did some more in-town cool. adventuring because we're still missing two people. Uh, when is the next Pew Pew trip? That's a great question. Mm -hmm. uh, hopefully as soon as it's healthy. Pew Pew is healthy. I mean, Everyone's healthy. Pew Pew is healthy. Right? Yeah, we're all healthy. As far as I know. But, um, um, but as far as going to laser tag, um, I mean... Wild. Yeah, we still got a little bit of time before everything starts getting fully back to normal. So. Excuse me. I wouldn't have played laser tag as much as yeah, the Yeah, I've been person. itching pretty bad to play. Yeah, it sounds great. Um, but when it's time, it's time. Can't rush it. Yup. The... But as soon as it is time... Oh, yeah, I'll be there, like, every weekend. We should, like... You know what we should do, though? We should do, like, a thing. We should, like, a big thing, you know? We should get everybody involved. I like big we things. Do, like a like a like a, 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 a tour road trip thing that we've been talking about. Okay. Go big or go home, bro. I like it. Yeah. Party and shit. Okay. 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 <laughs> What's the route? <laughs> anyway, that's a great question. I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I was planning, just thinking which about comes it. When we oh, look at that. I told you Boom Nasty would be in here to roast me at some point. I like big things. Mm -hmm. I, sh I sure you do. Are you missing an M, sir? Mm hmm. I look forward to kicking Brat's butt in Waukesha. Oh, yeah, it's definitely going to happen. Yeah, I mean, do it. I look forward to being there while you do it. <laughs> I mean, you technically, you did better than me in the tournament, so you've, you've got me there, man. Show. I am, I am, I am nothing but humble. I feel like we've kind of started, like, a after the pandemic yeah. list. I got last <laughs> place. <laughs> 
And it's true. Um, did you actually? One of those things is definitely yeah. like mm-hmm. big group tour thing. Because that would be great. Yeah. It, it could also like it doesn't have to be like huge. Like it could just be like three locations or something easy. I don't know. There's like a lot. <laughs> The uh, laser tag that I would like to do. I definitely want to get back up to Michigan. Yes. I definitely want to go to Waukesha. I also want to go out and visit Bullseye. I think that'd be really fun. Get out to the East Coast. Um, And now that Lake Charles is open, I mean, that's a way far drive. That would be a flying trip. But uh, just seeing all of them once it's safe to get out there again, that's going to be great. Yeah, I'm so excited to just be able to do anything like largely social again yeah i miss hugging my friends Ugh, I'm oh you're about hugger. to cry aren't you huh i can see it in your eyes what you're about to cry no <laughs> not, i just i yawned all right leave me alone <laughs> just dunked on yourself uh, <laughs> no i i really am though anyway 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 yeah um so yeah our it's good to hear that everyone's good uh folks out in the chat how has your week's been we always like to hear from you we'll shout you out on the show yeah what's going on tell us about your lives what's popping good looking uh what's popping don't mind me just watching want to hit that beat just dropping i don't think that's how it goes i don't actually know i've never heard the rest of it <laughs> by the way happy new year everybody yeah. Uh, it's 2021, but it still feels like it's actually December 37th. December 37th? Oh, God. <laughs> December 37th, 2020. It's, it's the hidden 13th month of 2020. Hidden 13th month? It's the, yeah, hidden, yeah. Q, fuck you, it's the hidden second year of 2020. There we go. Welcome to 2020 Part 2, Electric Boogaloo. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, there we go. Did you just give us a chicka chicka? I did. You watched way too much Ferris Bueller music earlier. <laughs> Bow, bow. I accidentally pretty bow, much bow. set a piece of toast on fire this Oh my time. god, we have a Sean sighting in the chat. Uh oh. Oh, man. oh, he wants a random sound bite. Sean. I got random you. Sound bite meme. Oh, yeah, Sean. come on, let's go. <laughs> Request, <laughs> redeem, like, oh. Piece of, of toast on fire. Are we talking a toaster situation or like a toaster oven? Like, what's the circumstance here? <laughs> oh, <Got me>. <laughs> again? <laughs> Yeah, it was a pretty good random one. Microwave. Wait, oh. what? How did you set a piece I'm, of toast on fire in the microwave? I am. How do you even make toast in the microwave? I am confused. All I know is you make hot bread. <laughs> All I know is hot bread. <laughs> hot bread, yeah. All know is hot bread. All <laughs> know <go>. hot bread. <laughs> how short can coochie you microwave that? coochie bread? Oh, the, oh my goodness. <laughs> Nope, not gonna do that. This man. I think you're doing it wrong. I think you might be right. I think you're doing it wrong. I mean, whatever. <laughs> Wait, it was like okay. a cheese toast thing with cheese from Walmart. I sat in the microwave too long, and boom, the kitchen covered in smoke. Was there like a wrap on it? That makes like, a lot more sense. Cheese doesn't just like explode. I, I, who cares? <laughs> What? No, no rap on it. Well, wow, the cheese just decided that it was time to end. It. My random or my random sound generator just gave us these nuts three times in a row. Nice. <laughs> is it though? All right. Well, is it me, Jesus? <laughs> That's an eventful time. Anybody else have something they'd like to share with the chat? <laughs> Anybody else have anything interesting that's happened last week? I just got a news update. I just got permission from a undisclosed news source. Are you staring at me? <laughs> I closed it. I just got notice from an undisclosed news source that I can tease information that's going to become public next week, but I can't say what it actually is. Wait, why don't I know what it is? Because I can't disclose my sources. What? We. It's called journalistic efficacy. Did you say <laughs> efficacy? I did. <laughs> it would be efficacy, first of Ooh, all. Okay. <laughs> I'm pregnant. Well. Pregnant? No way. 
<laughs> no way. No way. Let me see the test so I know it's real. I got a Milo on my you desk. Have I'm to torturing show it him. Now. You oh have to. You God. can't just drop that bombshell and not be. <laughs> uh, so we'll get to that a little later in the show. This has quickly devolved. I just wanted to know how you guys were. Okay. It's because anyway. you weren't following the gimmick of talking like AM radio. Are you still doing that? <laughs> I never stopped. Uh, yeah. He's... Chris has kept it going. Like, he has... So anyway. So say hello to everybody. How many? Okay. Can somebody put a counter like on my hello. face? How many times can I say so anyway? I'm going to stop using that as a transitionary phrase. What are you doing to the poor cat? He looks evil. Stop. <laughs> I hate it. He's vibing. That can't be good for his eyes, Bubby. He's vibing. Oh, he yes. Yeah. He looks crazy. Please get Shake my him cat again. out of that <laughs> Shake He's him a again. good boy, I swear. He's not. He's a brat, but... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, okay? mm -hmm. Do you want to come to Mama's blanketed lap where she's not going to hold you in front of mean lights? Okay, let's let me no. just let me just okay. search something up here. So you still love dad calling yeah, PETA, that's animal abuse. I'm sorry that we not eat the d delicious animal. Oh ha ha. You can't cancel See where you're going with there. <laughs> you aren't you know who, so you're screwed. Yes, you're right. I am not Alinity. I am not allowed Peter, to just eat cats. Oh trust me, my cat will call PETA for you, don't worry about it. Oh PETA? I'll call PETA for you. I yawned this morning, and my owners didn't say Ooh, big stretches. You mean Ooh, big yawn? Oh yeah, whatever. Big stretches. I have a cat shoulder. I got a, a, a shoulder on the on the pirate. He's yes, a guy. cat on the pirate. <laughs> he is purring so loud. Jesus. No. My Nick, I just looked just at your comment on that Facebook post. Two. Can't wait for that. Okay. Ooh, Oculus. Yeah. Nice. I am currently checking Saturday Waukesha sessions. Okay, oh, that's cool. what else I was doing. Nice. Yeah. Oh, we're, oh, you had the same 15. idea. Okay. <laughs> no, I was checking the top fifteen. That oh, comment that was rudely ignored. I just saw it now. That's why. What was the comment? I wonder how many good people are on those steps. Oh. Wait, whose post was that on yours or mine? Oh, it was on yours. It wasn't ignored. I read it and chuckled, and I moved on. Now, did you no. chuckle or did you chortle? It was a chuckle. It's most chuckle? certainly not a chortle. It okay. was a chuckle. <laughs> that comment was It was a chuckle. Honestly, Little I thought boy. it was really it funny. Was I just chuckle. like I didn't react to it on Facebook. Sorry, oh, fam. Love patience. you. Last seven days. Now you know how most of my comments go online, Nick. I'm the wildest kitty in the West. Nobody's got a faster draw than me. <laughs> Sorry. What just happened? <laughs> what actually just happened? I'm making content. <laughs> Alright, so we are going to have a discussion about game types that you would like to see in iCombat or rules that you'd like to see put in. Stuff that changes the game up. Use your creativity. It's not that changes the game. We've done that so many times. Well, but like, new, game. Good, good, good. new game types. Sure, new game types. Retro probably, imagination. New game types. There's but first. probably something else that people have thought about by yeah, now. I'm sure. Um, but first, we have a top 10. But wait, there's more. Actually, it's a top 15. Yes, top 15. Ooh, I'm getting a needy. I'm, he's making some biscuits over here. Oh, now he's working for free? The biscuit man is making biscuits. Oh, Usha. Nick, okay. while well, you're on the line with PETA, can you, get, can you get Osha on the horn, too? On the horn. <laughs> All right. In 15th place for the week, we have Doki from Madison, Wisconsin, with 32,000 points. Okie dokie. In 14th, we have Jim Miller, falling out of first. 33,000 points from Waukesha. 13th place, we got Louis Boudian from Dubai, with 37,000 points. 12th place, we have Kor. <laughs> From Dubai with 37,000 points. Third oh, place is Mac 20 from Madison with 41,000 points. Tenth place is Snake 23 from Rochester, 42,000 points. Ninth place is One Philip from O'Fallon with 43,000 points. Eighth place is Tokyo from Dubai with 46,000 points. Seventh place is Sniper 17 from Waukesha. 
47,000 points. Sixth place is J1911 from Rochester, 49,000 points. Fifth place is Jolly Black, 56. Lake Charles hitting the leaderboard for the week at 51,000 points. Fourth place is Meth Morrow, Rochester, 51,000 points. Nice. Third place is Kill Switch, Rochester, 58,000 points. Nice. Second place, 5BZZ, 5BZZ from Dubai, 60,000 points. And first place for the week, Key, Rochester, 68,000 points. Congratulations to all of you wonderful people. Good job. I'm All so right. tired right now. It's so. Are you? Yep, so guys. I'm All right. Well, that's the stream. People play not regularly still. Make sure you uh, hit that like button. Ring the bell. Comment and subscribe. Subscribe. Buy our merch that we don't have. Honestly, we should get gear swap merch. That I wanted so to make gear swap merch a long time ago. I've just never gotten around to it. That would be genius. <laughs> I wish yeah. I had that sound bite. That would have been the first. Why one don't to buy I have that, that sound? Yeah. Take yeah. my money. I'm sure a lot of people would want them. Um, you know what? Let's work on that for the next couple of weeks. I like it. Bird, you're a design major. Get on it. I sure am. Like, Not a major anymore. Got a whole degree. Yeah, you could have a de degree. degree. Got a whole, got a whole uh, a piece of card stock to prove it. Did you actually get it yet? No. Oh. Dang. Uh, One can hope. You, you'll get it when you get it. Um, yeah, pretty much. All right, yep. so we have a discussion for this week. It is currently 9.28 p.m. in Central Time. Woo! And our discussion for the week is, what games would you like to see played at iCombat? What game? The world is your oyster. You can think of anything. Basketball. Oh, man. Oh, we got a, we got a hot one coming well, out of the chat immediately. Uh, get, well, right up, right up there. Toyvi, we discussed setting up CSGO type tournament, 5v5, plant a bomb mid-game in designated areas, other team have to defuse it, would be fun and challenging. I like that. Um, uh, what's it called? Uh, Battle House Laser Tag does that, yeah. Oh, That's really? Pretty cool. Yeah, I literally, I physically had to take a thing, put it on the ground, hold a button to activate the diffuser and then uh -huh. defend it with my life for the next 30 seconds that's awesome that's cool i like that's that a really lot. cool i'm a fan their, their equipment's kind of like funny ah gotcha because <laughs> it's still attached like it's one of those guns that's still attached to your like <laughs> headband and you can only die by headshot like it's a whole thing over there mm -hmm. so that's really dope love that i like that idea like would there be like designated spots on the field or do you just have to put it like somewhere in the middle? Uh, for my experience, or like the, I just got both is good. I mean, share, your yeah, share your experience. Share your experiences. Like for my experience, there, they already had designated spots where you had to go. Okay, that cool. kind of makes sense though, I guess, because like if it kind of becomes like your, you know, um, like regular. Yeah, it's like your target. It's go been to? so long since we, I feel like we've actually talked about laser tag that I don't know what I'm saying. Domination. No. Objective. Oh, Thank there you, you go. Uh -huh. Like your your basic objective game, where like you know what it is you're supposed to be getting to, what you're supposed to do, how to complete the task, whatever. Then you do it. Nice. Um, it would be cool to have like. <laughs> I was needing. Okay. I was needing him, and he didn't <laughs> it like it. It would be cool to have like um. I can't talk right now. Yeah, what's going on? You need to take five. Yep. I'll right. let you guys carry. Take a breather. Right. Tommy says to emulate CS:GO, it should have designated spots. Yes, I yeah. agree. I agree. I like that a lot, actually. Is that something that's important? You think that it does emulate CS:GO? Yeah, it's a pretty strict game. Mm -hmm. Like the bomb spot should be somewhere where the defenders can get to first. Okay. Like, but not a lot. Just like briefly get there, not like long enough to set up. Uh -huh. Like you're getting there like a second or two ahead of time. Yeah, you should be able to get there and then like what look around for like two seconds and then see the enemy. Like yeah. Mhm. Mm and then uh, what to what else was there? I think I already mentioned this, but mm -hmm. I want to see more like I want to try a multi-team game. You know, like imagine that would be fun too. 
Yeah, imagine like Team Deathmatch, but with three teams instead of just cam- yeah. Black and Camel going at it. I think that yeah. that kind of just requires a different setup of field, though, which is totally fine. That would take a little bit more work, yes, on where you would go. Mm-hmm. To in- yeah, because pretty much all eye combat fields are set up on team versus team, just two teams. Yeah. Um, just because of the way that it is created. Um. But, I mean, if you set up some type of, like, auto-respawning in that, you could easily set up a multiplayer team deathmatch, or multi-team team deathmatch, and that'd be pretty fun. Mm -hmm. Unless it's, like, put a spawn tube in each corner of the map and then see where that goes. That's true. Yeah, it's not bad. I I had had a game type that I was thinking about, like, way back when I combat open. It's not realistic at all, because... (laughs) Griffball is is a game that I think is totally doable. Uh, We'll get to that in a second. It was so doable! (laughs) Um, yeah, it was a lot of fun when we did that, but the one I was thinking about was a variant of Sniper. Um, I mean, Sniper can be super oppressive if you have someone that's, like, really accurate and quick at shooting their gun. Um, but setting it up, it was, I think I nicknamed it, like, uh, like, like, 1920-something, like, whenever World War One was, 17, 1917 or something, and it was, all the guns were one shot, and you had to reload between each shot. Oh! One in the chamber, okay. Yeah, but it's like, so it's one-shot kills, but you can't, like, go ape shit on seven people in a row. You actually have to be strategic. Like, if you miss the shot, you lose the bullet and all that, yeah. Right. Yeah, and, like, each time, maybe not, like, dropping the mag and reloading, but, like, c- c- like cocking the, just the rack pull would the be. Candle back. Yeah, just charge mm-hmm. it each time. The Rainbow Six thing that, um... Thermit's talking about sounds interesting. Yeah, Rainbow Six is fun. Set up on the field, and then the attackers got to enter through any door to rescue the hostage. Aha! So is it like a legit person, or is it just like, or is it just the UBL body? Like, yeah. It'd be cool if it was a person. I feel like Mm -hmm. because it'd kind of be like Juggernaut style, but you actually like have to bring the person back to your spawn. Yeah, that would be kind of interesting. Oh, it was Cage. Okay, cool. Yeah, okay. I like that. That's like what we did at the Wacky Day, uh, where and they had people running around with the uh, with the extra bags. It was miserable. You didn't miss anything. Really think I? I feel like it probably would have been fun. Yeah, possibly. Because like you know, I, I feel like that's one of those things you probably don't you shouldn't take seriously. Like, no, enjoy it. Well, <laughs> for what it is, they. <laughs> Uh-oh. They took out like the consistency of the game and left in the infuriating parts, which was what I hated. <laughs> Well, that's that was kind of the point though like but it was cute like they had the things where it was like make your gun do funky noises and stuff like that's fun. oh that's fun that was fun but like Thank randomly you. reloading into sir. reloading into four bullets that was not fun why not it's a jokey yeah see sean well, y'all take it too serious i'm sure Sounds like them. <laughs> I would stand and spawn and just reload until I see, oh, look, 100 bullets. Okay, right. that's going to be fun. <laughs> yeah. So no, let's it was, go. It was all right. Let's go waste the clip, boys. Uh, yeah, I just see. be going everywhere. Yeah, there we go. Pre-fire. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think Griff- I walked out with an accuracy of 0.1 that session. Griffball was a great time. Griffball was fun. For the few times that we played it. Have you guys ever, like, constructed, like, a game, like... By yourself though like from the ground up oh that I'm isn't that based creative. off of like another i tried to do that like with um dom tubes for a long time when i worked there and i think they did have one that i really liked and then i just i never wrote it down or anything because i'm mm-hmm. dumb dumb so i don't remember what it was at all <laughs> the i don't know if it was in the works before i gave the suggestion but like the basics of rush is something that i talked to phil and them about we talked about that and then it came out yeah i was like yeah, basically the idea oh, and convenient. and a little bit of hacker was kind of something that I had shot an idea out. But for like hacker, my idea for them was um, just having more domination tubes. Mm-hmm. So instead of just having the three, like put like six or something on the field. Mixed uh, or fixed balance versions of medics and infected would be interesting. That would be really fun. I like, barely even know how the game is played because I've, I I don't actually think I've ever played it before. Medic is. A fun game. 
Um, so the basics of medic. No, I know how to play it, baby. Oh, okay. I went over all the rules on our podcast. I remember. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> well, for the people that like, don't know. Okay. We fair. did one game a week. And... Yeah. So the the basics of medic are it's like a laser tag or not laser tag. It's a laser tag, <laughs> but it's a um. All of its laser tag. It's like freeze tag, <laughs> where if you get killed, you stand in spot as though you're actually dead on the field, and your medic has to come and heal you. Yup. Um. Yeah, it's the the only reason it doesn't work is because the way that the headbands interact with the SMGs, uh, the way that the headband sends out the healing command isn't compatible with the new system. It only worked on the old system where the controls and the guts for the game were in the backpack, not the gun. Mm-hmm. Oh, bummer. Yeah, so it's like it's an actual hardware issue. It cannot be played. Oh, which is super yeah. unfortunate. Yeah. That sucks. Um, but there are games, like, I know one of the settings in ICE that people don't use often is the automatic respawn. Um, I mean, there's settings in there where you can have people automatically respawn after 20 seconds of being dead. Mm-hmm. Um, that's something that's pretty interesting. Uh, what else can you do? I feel like another thing that, like, goes into, like, actually knowing, like, how to create a game, especially in that mm-hmm. system, is, like, understanding how it works. So I feel like that's kind of like a caveat to being able to do that. Well, that's the, like, yeah. I feel like there are some things that, like, in theory you could do, but, like, you just can't run it through the system. I'll be back in one second. Yeah. Bye. But, um, yeah. I don't know. I think I had, like, at one point um, tried to come up with... Um, like a dominator game that used four dom tubes and it was like instead of having them I think it was mostly like when I was doing a lot of team leading on Alcatraz because I don't think you could really do it on a smaller like smaller map you maybe could but like where you have four dom tubes and it's kind of like a capsule flag situation but not really but you would like go like they would be in four corners and you would have to go to the diagonal ones if that makes any sense. Just, like, switching up, like, the the shapes, yeah. basically. I hear what you're saying. Also, I feel like it would make it more interesting, I, f- specifically for Alcatraz, because the reason that I was thinking about doing it like that is because I just feel like people, unless you're, like, you have specific play styles on that map, like, you wouldn't go through the middle very much. Like, there would be a lot of sessions where the middle would just be straight up fucking dead. So I feel like it would encourage more gameplay through, like, the middle of the map, which would have been interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Again, get- I don't really remember at all what I was thinking when I was trying to come up with it, but it's just trying to get make full use of the entire map. So. Yeah, basically, that was a lot of what I I was interested in doing too, because I felt like a lot of games were just like, especially in Alcatraz, it's just like there was so much wasted space, so much of the time. If it wasn't like a packed session with like a lot of at least decent to really good regulars, oh. like that shit would be dead. I mean, yeah, you paid for the whole map, you're gonna use the whole map. <laughs> he would just stay upstairs till he was forced to respawn. Oh, I hear that. I don't That's a bummer. I, what What do you mean, though? Because, like, what's it called? You You know how Brat said you could, re- like, the medic obviously would bring people back to life, but, like, after about 30 seconds or so, everyone would, everyone who's dead would just come back to life. And oh, just play from there. right, 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 right. Like, you then, didn't have to go back to spawn. Yeah, yeah like, uh, every... If you're willing to wait the 20 to 30 seconds, you could just progress through your... Progress through the map until you get to your spot. Uh, like, every 30 seconds until you die. So, apparently, there was just one player that would just... Just w- work his way upstairs as each life went on. Mm-hmm. And it was kind of, it would get... It would probably get irritating from there because, like, that person just wouldn't move. Right. So. Right, 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 right. Yes, and that then, would indeed be interesting, Thermit. Okay. Like, mess with the grenades to make a claymore. Oh, that'd be amazing. Mm-hmm. So you don't have to be there. Well, yeah. So, or yeah. chuck it at somebody right. and risk fucking concussing them. Dude, those things are deadly. Yeah, that those was a that was so a huge <laughs> that was a huge problem on 
uh, the elimination style games. I always respond to people as soon as they hit like 15 seconds of being dead. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we had um, to but there's the tons going. of people that were just like, like a lot of the people that just ran ice didn't care, so they would just, eh, whatever. Yeah. Like standing in spawn, meh, meh, meh. But yeah. Oh yeah, just stand in spawn and just like, yep, yeah, mm-hmm. cool, whatever. Then the team leader would like press the button, and then it's like, oh hey, you're still there. Uh, <laughs> you're still alive, or yeah. you should be. I thought it was funny. I got to the other base one time, and there were people doing that, and I hit the button while I was standing there, in their spawn. It's like, all right, who's alive? Okay, I didn't know if that's what you guys were talking about. I thought it was, but it was just worded weird. But yeah, what's that? The respawn thing for yeah. elimination and the thirty-second respawn rule, like. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's hard to keep tabs on every player that's like. Because one person could go down, that you could start like a mental 30 second timer, but then understand. all these other people would die. Oh, and there's then it's only like, like what there's happened? only some people that actually took advantage of it. I didn't even really understand though, like why you would even do that. Because, like, at the end of the day, like, they're just going to know that you're there. Right. So, what's the point? Like, you might as well just go out and either, like, die on the field or. Mm-hmm live like, like get another one or two on if, if you're not respawn yeah. and you're and you're somebody who's just sitting in spawn like they're going to come looking for you there yeah and i mean let's let's be let's be completely honest nobody really enjoys playing elimination i think and like purposely staying keeping yourself alive that long only prolongs the game yeah yeah, I'm not a fan of it. I'm not. I'm, uh, I'm also I'm not really a fan of it. I feel like there's like ways that you could use it to your advantage, but like only for a second. Mm-hmm. I like I would use it every now and again just to like catch my breath and be like, okay, yeah, like let me get my yeah get my shit like, together. Getting back to base, catching my... your breath, and going again is one thing. Getting to your base, standing around for two minutes, yeah, and watching people come in and out. That's a that's a different thing. It'd yeah. be my rest game. Like I would probably waste both lives in the first thirty seconds, and then use the rest of the time to rest and like nope. catch my breath. And that then... that do be how it is, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, military intel yeah. is so much better than elimination. It depends you on the field you're playing. You get like it makes you like. It's like if I can't if I can't move to get the bag, then I can move to defend the bag. Oh, yeah. I hate both of those games. Intel is okay. I loved Intel at Madison. In military because there was actually strategy to it because the bag was so hard to get to. I just love objective games. If there's something that I have to go and get or a task that I have to do, your girl is about it. Yeah. Safe cracker in... I always love the grapes cracker much. I yeah, safe cracker is fine. I love the safe cracker. Nobody can tell me shit bad about that game. Sorry, you just can't do it. I said what I I said. I will always ask Sixes to run that game for me every time I I, visit. That's one of the biggest reasons I'm pissed off that Madison doesn't exist anymore because that game on that field. Oh man! So much fun. So the one much One time fun. I played it, even though we lost both times, it was still a blast, dude. One of the first <laughs> times I played it on that field, I won. Nice. Oh really? I did. Yeah, no big deal or whatever. Low key, one of my favorite games that is like not able to be played really anymore. It was Terminator. 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 Oh, oh man, it's been a while since I played Vito. that one. I just got canceled. It's a, <laughs> it's a no for me, babe. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, Terminator is fun. I like the idea of having like a small team with more hit points versus a large team. That that's like one of the reasons I like Black Hawk Down too. Terminator still, just like I feel like Terminator is just like I'm whoever I forgot who's like the people who just like farm points the entire time. Yeah, I know. It's like all it is. <laughs> no, I usually end up being the human. I think I've only been Terminator maybe once. I just like the idea of like playing strategically. Terminator sucks. Like you just you can't throw yourselves at the Terminator. You have to actually play smart. But most people don't play smart. Smart. You gotta use your brain. (laughs) I ain't even gonna say it. All right. (laughs) I already said what I had to say. It's a personal opinion. I liked it. 
Terminator, uh-huh. I think it's okay. I could take it or leave it. Yeah. But it's nice teaming up with, like, people on the other team that you want to be with. Like, mm-hmm. I think Terminator is, like, the only time I've ever teamed up with, Co- like, Unicorn Rage, or it's the first time I've teamed up with Sixes, or, like, sure. anyone on the Waukesha crew that I'm... Because I'm usually with, like, I'm... Th- Who's usually on my team every time I go up there? Jay Woodland. He's always on my team. <laughs> like, it's yeah. always a funny time. Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, I, I made everyone so mad last time I went up there. Mm-hmm. I went on automatic for Sniper. It was amazing. Um, I already have a hard time playing. His face, you can probably tell. He was like, oh, damn. <laughs> you lost. <laughs> I don't like it. He was. I was like, "Yeah, we 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 did lose by a hundred. It's uh, that's on me." Uh, but like, I'm dead. I got a bunch of kills though. <laughs> nice. So, um, I'm also a fan of Borg. I don't think that's another Borg. one. I don't think oh, I've played. Man. Or like, I I know the rules kind of, but I'd never played it before. Um, have you not played it any time in Walker? Borg is the is one uh, they play it occasionally, yeah. But I don't think I've played it there. No, you haven't. Uh, Borg is the game where uh, one team is the Borg and all of their health is combined together into one giant health pool, uh-huh. yep. and they don't die until all their health is gone. Oh yep. yeah. No. And the other team are the humans, and they have to respawn in their one shot kills. Yeah, I haven't. That sounds like fun though. I like that. And that's the new it's... respawning rules. It's much more fair. The old respawning rules. It was miserable to be a human. It was. Oh my gosh. It was all like respawn, hide, and then get like two shots off before you die. Right. No. Yeah. That sounds like a good, uh, a fun game. I yeah. feel like. Yeah. It's a. It's a fun one. Also, like you have to do the teamwork thing, which is why I like objective games. <laughs> Even though one person time, could drag down the entire games, team in Borg. Teamwork don't happen. Yeah. Um, I will say, I now that we're game. about 10 minutes from the end of the show here, uh, with Whoa, all of the talk yeah, about... Fast. Yes, one fast. Uh, with all the talk about game types and things we'd like to see, etc., uh, I have been told, and this is your news for the week here, I have been told that at Waukesha... They will be demoing and testing a new game type this coming week. Didn't you send a message about that? They put a message on their Facebook. Yeah. Is it saying is that it, it was going to be happening? Uh, but, I got the email. Yeah, I got like, I, I got, got a, the I got the message directly the from the horse's too, yeah. mouth um, saying that they are going to be testing and playing th- this weekend. So there you go. I want to be there. Hmm. Yeah. So go have fun with that. Was that like the news that you were like, I'm not gonna say? Yeah, that was it. Literally everybody knew about that. I know. Beta but test session some free. Didn't. Wait, you actually got an email? Yeah. Saturday, January thirtieth. I got something that said that. I didn't get an email. What the? F- it's this. It's right. Oh dang, my phone screen's too bright. Um, <laughs> here, let me just. No, it's fine. Let, don't worry about allow it. me to read. Uh, it's probably because I don't have my elite membership going right now. That's probably why. Oh. Uh, allow me to read said email. Oh, the elite um, members at Waukesha. There you go. Promise bigger and better things for your elite membership. Hope to fulfill that promise in 2021, starting with our first free beta test session on Saturday, January 30th, 2021 at noon. Our new our goal is to beta test our new game, Infiltration. Oh, there oh, you go. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where I saw that, but I definitely saw it, and I didn't get. I don't get emails from them for that because I don't have a membership right now at all. Yeah. Beta test session will only be open to the elite members, but. If spots are not filled, employees will fill the spots. Sounds like fun. Well, tell us how it is if y'all are going. Yeah, totally. Standard 90-minute session. Our goal is to put new games into play and get feedback from all of you. The session will be kept at 30. Uh, Call or come in person to reserve your spot, but the cost is free. We only ask that you uh, book your spot in advance. Love. There you go. Well, if y'all go do that, let us know. And wear a mask. We can talk about, oh yeah, don't get sick. That'd be bad. If there is additional time after game testing, we'll just run standard games that you guys want us to play. Okay, cool. Borg. Sounds uh, like legitness. <laughs> so that, that's a thing. Nice, nice. Noise, Thermit, noise. How do you get to Waukesha for it? Uh, are you willing to take that drive? <laughs> yeah, you just gotta swim across the lake, man. Yeah, uh, happen at happen at Kizar, 
Do and, you want me to uh, pick you up? <laughs> chuggity chuggity choo choo over to Wisconsin. That's how. <laughs> that Wait. is one way. What's up? If their mate goes to Wisconsin. Uh oh. Hold up. She said are we, wait. Uh, are we gonna are we gonna break our uh break our holding out? I'm not saying I mean I'm not girl it's I'm in the air. Dude, I'm just thinking about it. <laughs> oh god. This may be time for to fly. Oh wait, yeah. If you fly and I'm definitely not going, y'all but <laughs> Oh yeah, Babe, that's true. Play the sound bite. Play the sound bite. Play the sound bite. Play the sound Do bite. I have that? Oh, that one. <laughs> Guess what, hey. is? <laughs> Coronavirus. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> Thank you. That felt oh, apropos. Mm-hmm. Flying carpet. That was funny. Smooth. There it is. All right, cool. So that's the news. Um, I just went back and read the message. It, he says it's coming out soon, so it may not actually be this weekend. So that might be a lie. Yep. Uh, but keep your eyes out for the official. Uh, rule sets and everything for it. I know roughly what it is, but I've been asked not to say, so. Enjoy. Nice. All right. I think that that is going to kind of round us out here to the top of the hour, and uh, I'm tired, so I'd like to go to bed. Woo! <laughs> CP. Yeah, I CP. <laughs> I don't know right now. Oh, he's going to take a nap. I'm back. He's going to take back. a nap right there. Oh, I'm back. All right, well... This has been a very sleepy podcast because I'm tired too. Yeah, oh, yeah. Maybe Sean said maybe everyone. Uh, I'm hoping that when I weigh myself in this Saturday, I'm going to be in the 250s. Maybe I'll sneak out Ooh, this weekend. Look, and I have a neck. Tea. <laughs> Damn! Look at that neck, boy. That's a <laughs> thick ass boy. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. Ooh, a private flight. Nice. Private flight. Yeah, you could make that flight to Cessna or something pretty easily. It's only probably a three-hour flight. Wow, that's bougie as hell. All right, that's enough for tonight, y'all. Private flight. Who the fuck are you, people? They're Michiganians. Michiganers. Michigans. Haven't seen them in a while. Michigans. I love that. I hope you know that when we say that, it's all it's it's endearing. Mm -hmm. It's... I feel like when when we thought we had beef with each other, they really thought we meant it, and I just thought it was fun. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Cool. All right. What's your guys' weeks look like coming up here? I have another three day weekend. I was blessed yes, by my boss. Weekend. Nice. I was I was so happy when I saw that on the schedule. I was like, wait, I'm off Friday, Saturday, and nice. Sunday. That's more chances to try to go to Waukesha. Uh, like Nice. Love that. Then, well enjoy your time off. I will. I will. I'll probably be sleeping in, no doubt. Mm-hmm. Um Nice. And I'll be using this monitor to the max, but it's yes. 144 hertz. Hell yeah! Enjoy Here that smoothness, man. It's gonna take a while to get used to. It's uh, I'm still amazed every time I turn on my PC yeah. and then I just stare at the screen. Like, I'm like, wow. You'll notice too, like when you start moving your gun to aim for stuff, like it will feel different for a little bit. Yeah, I'm sitting here going, wow, and I haven't even logged in yet. But it's yeah. so smooth. Like I'm just staring. I'm staring at the wallpaper. It's like wow, mm-hmm. wow. <laughs> oh my god! Like Two hundred bucks for this, right? Love. Worth every penny. Love. And- <laughs> nice, cool. Bird, what you got? Um. Well, surprise, surprise. I'm gonna be training probably all weekend. Whoa. Um. Currently figuring out if I might be taking some type of certification this weekend and next weekend. I just have to allocate the resources for it. (laughs) So that's a possibility. Allocate resources. Yeah. Sneaks out this weekend. (laughs) I'll sneak out this weekend. What does that mean? So that's that's um something that is possibly going to happen, depending. Um, and then um I've allocated resources. (laughs) <laughs> uh outside of that like not too much um i'm mostly just um working on training getting my certifications so that i can make money so yeah would you like to promote your twitter or your instagram yeah if you guys want to follow my poll instagram you totally can i'll put it in the chat 
Say it out loud. What? Just do it. It's at Boot Scootin' Birdie. Boot Scootin' Birdie. There we go. I hate that you like it so much. I came up with it. I'm a marketing Great machine. Name. I think that's how it's See, spelled Sean for my it. at. So uh, here's my thing. Feel free to follow it if you'd like. <laughs> that's my poll Instagram. There but we yeah. go. Awesome. Um, cool. Yeah. So that's the tea. Uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's probably going to be my week is focusing on training. Like always. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's the tea. That's Very the tea, cool. <laughs> With sugar. I'm um, going to suck some air for a second. All right. So my week coming up, I have no no boss at work. He is out in coronavirus country right now. Oh, my now. God. Yeah. That means if he Goodness doesn't, gracious. I'm going to throw hands. He, he has a lot of antique cars, and he's down at, he's trying to sell them currently at the Mecham auction in Tallahassee, Florida. Mm-hmm. So once he gets back, I'm going to be quarantining because God knows he's not going to wear a mask at work. Um, so I'll be back on the quarantine train for two weeks. So that'll be great. Oh, I should probably go see mom before that happens. Try and stay the fuck away from him while you guys are working. I do. I always put a mask on when I'm around I do not him. trust that man as yeah. far as I can throw him. And I know for damn sure I can't throw him. So That's true. Um, <laughs> so I'll be doing that in two weeks. So that'll be fun. Um, I am also doing D and D still. So we got, uh, our group is probably leaving town for the first time. Yeah, I, I agree with you 100, Sean. You That's can't just be the right thing safe. to do. Yeah, you can't see that. Yeah. Um, so they're probably going to be leaving the first safe town that they've been to. So that's going to be fun. We'll see how they react to that. Mm. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Dota. Oh, by the way, if anybody plays Magic the Gathering and you are a fun and avid commander player, there is software or web-based portal that we can use to play commander over the internet together. My brother and I did it last weekend. It was a hell of a lot of fun. I know that Thermit has a deck. He said he wants to play. Birdie's got a deck. Uh, she can definitely play if anybody else has commander decks and they want to play. Uh, we can set up a time to play some four-player commander. That would be a good time. Fancy deck box. Ooh. Yeah, we got Ooh. that. That you can't fucking see because the lighting on my side of the fucking office is trash, but that's fine. Sorry. It's still there. It's a thing. It exists. Yeah. Uh, so that's that. Uh, otherwise, my week is going to be pretty low-key, so I'm excited. Oof. Oh, um, that's terrifying. Yeah, that's really rough. And like the scariest thing is always it's like don't go anywhere. It just randomly picks people. It's also, like, like you I'm, get it's fucked. It's weird cuz I haven't gotten it but I'm the highest risk cuz I work at a hospital and like well yeah, but the hospital also takes like a certain level of precautions that most people don't. And I stock covid floors. So like <laughs> then again I got vaccinated. But it only works like partially and all that. So yeah, many that's levels. Why, <laughs> yep. That's why we wash our hands a lot. Just do your due diligence. That's literally it. Yeah, no, we're fine. We're almost there. We got maybe six months until oh, it's getting um, safer. I are say you six sure? months. COVID are says you sure? otherwise. By summer, I think that things are going to get pretty much back to normal. Depending on how the COVID, the COVID, that was COVID. vaccine and COVID put together, the COVID goes, how the immunization the rollout coronis. happens. Uh-huh. That's really gonna determine how the summer goes. What is like the super strain of COVID called? Is it just COVID twenty? It's like COVID nineteen dash one or something. It has like a, a letter code after it. Just say super COVID. Yeah, that's all you need to do. <laughs> all right. So outside of that, that's gonna be the show for the week. It's ten p.m. We've had a great show. Oh, hold on. <clears throat> I have to get back in character. Oh. It's been a uh, wonderful show tonight, guys. We. Really appreciate you all being out here with us. For the folks who have stuck around until the end of the show, I'm going to give you all a shout out really quick. Uh, still hanging out with us here at the end. We've got all three of your hosts, Brady Bratson, Reiner Brown. We have Powers, also chilling in the moderation spot. I believe I saw Boom Nasty out there before, but he's not showing up in my user list anymore. So He was 
He was here. You know, he, was he here. lurks for like a second and That's then true. leaves. Uh, in he lurks to them, until he gets a chance to criticize Bratz and then leaves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He dunks and then he walks. Mm. Gassy. Oh, I made broccoli cheddar soup tonight. Oh, that was good. And I feel so bad for Birdie. I made mm -hmm. smoothies. They were delicious. She did make smoothies. Anyways, uh, we have Aiton in the chat, Commander Root, Fire Mandrill, Frankenstein, Frog Champ, Go With Him, Liana, Live for the Moment, Mr. Extra Gun, Sean316, Tresino, Awakened by Sheep, and Wavy Dexterity. Thank you guys all for coming out tonight. We appreciate your support. We do have those goals that we're aiming to get to at the end of January. Remember, your support helps us to give away free sessions. Uh, I think I'm session. at this point I'm like running a tab <laughs> with Waukesha. Uh, so that's kind of fun. But uh, we will always hook you guys up as soon as we are able to cover the cost. So thank you. We appreciate it. That being said, that is it for this week. Any last words from any of you guys? No, thanks for hanging out with us for another week. You guys are the best. I love it here. Absolutely. We love you all. We look forward to doing this again next week. We will be back in seven days. That is going to be the 13th of January, 2021. Uh, hopefully, America won't be trying to rip itself apart, but I don't suspect much is going to change between now and then. Oh, my gosh. We are constantly at each other's throats. Yeah, it's wild. Um, it, it's not going to end. 2021 but, just started. But the Day biggest thing is that we love you guys, and we thank you for coming out every week. We are going to continue doing this every single week. You guys want to do a community show next week? Have everybody on? Just chat it up? Sure. I'm Why not? Down. All right, I'm community show next me. week. I'm, I'm always, always I'm always down for the, the chat, chat it up. Stuff. Community show next week. Everybody get your cameras ready. We're going to uh, we're gonna have everybody on. We'll talk. We'll shoot the shit. Maybe we'll play some Gearbox or something. Gearbox? Or what's that game called? Jackbox? Jackbox. Gearbox. Jackbox. <laughs> Love that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll play some Gearbox. Gearbox. <laughs> okay. This is what happens when we go I past think, time. I think when I hit that soundbite, we actually get copy striked. So, all right. Do that's fine. Really? Uh, there's a couple sound bites that will, like uh, the coffin dance, 100% of the time will. Oh, that makes sense. Looks like I'm not playing the eight. There you go, Thermit. Attaboy. Oh, man. All right, guys, we're out of here. We love you. We're going to go out to uh, some Mega Man 2. Use hand sanitizer. Use your sanitizer, wear your masks, have a great time. Uh, cool. Period. All right, music's playing. We're out of here. We love you guys. We'll see you in one week. Have a great night, everybody.